Um, so a while back I did Sissel and she was absolutely beautiful um, with the reaction that we did. And it was very soft and smooth and just praiseworthy. So I received another request for Sissel. And this one is my tribute to God be the glory. Y'all already know I love the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. I'm here about it all day, every day, any day. I have a second channel that is completely faith-based. That's That information is in the description box below if you ever want to check it out. You don't have to, but, you know, if you ever want to check it out, you can. Um, and and I'm here to talk about it. I'm, when I have an opportunity to talk about it here, I love to talk about it because I can't do anything without Jesus. And to, to his name is all the glory. It's never my glory. It's always his glory. So... Um, that being said, this song, To God Be the Glory, is just, how can I not want to hear it? <laughs> I mean, honestly. And I think she has such a remarkable voice. So, absolutely ready to hear this. And, yeah, you guys already know I link ways in the description box below for you to show love and support to the artist and um, help them grow their channel. So, that being said, let's not waste any more time and let's get right into it. Mm -hmm. you gave to prove your love to me and the voices of a million angels could not express my gratitude all that I am and ever hope to be I owe it all to thee You know, something I heard very profoundly, um, and, and this comes from Bishop Robert Barron, and at the time he was Father Barron, um, and it kind of hit home. It's like, wow, I never even thought about it like that. We didn't need to be created. <laughs> like... God created us. He didn't need us. <laughs> we need him. You know, everything that we are, everything we ever hope to be is because of him. And that really hit a chord with me because I guess I never thought about it that way. He loved us into existence. So there is nothing that we will ever be able to give or do for him that's ever going to equal up to anything. We just got to love him. Just be in obedience to him. And believe it or not, it's not that hard to do. It's just my personal opinion on the matter. But that first verse just kind of brought me back to that. And I liked it a lot. I liked it a lot because it is very profound because it is very true. You know, like, our kids are brought into existence. We didn't need to have kids, right? So no matter what our kids do, we're still going to give them unconditional love because we love our children, right? Hope we do. So there's nothing that they can ever give us that's going to change that love that we have. All we want is for them to love us and to be in obedience, you know, not under a rule of thumb, there's a big difference, but in obedience, saying, you know, 
my mother and father taught me these things. They taught me well. They taught me to be a good human being and that they spread that outward. And that's what the father wants from us. So, yeah, I love that. <laughs> I love that in her own unique way, she's taking us to church with this song. Like, it started off as a beautiful, like, ballad of a song, and now it's like full blown choir, and she is feeling it. You know, she's feeling that presence, and so now she's taking us to church with this performance. I just absolutely love that. I think it's just beautiful and she's always like every song that i've heard from her and not that i've heard very many from her but all of them have been all faith-based and i'm here for it you know so i love listening to her she has a great voice an amazing voice and it's absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful Wow. Very beautiful. Very beautiful indeed. That was a wonderful, wonderful song. And I loved every second of that. We have a lot to be thankful for, even in the hard times that we're facing right now, guys. And honestly, I, I really feel like we're living in prophetic times, but that's a whole nother conversation that maybe I'll put on the other channel. <laughs> I'm not sure exactly how I would approach that, but you know, I, th I feel like we are. And 
like I read the book. <laughs> I know who wins. So, yeah. To God be the glory. Every day, all day, any day. Anyway, that's going to do it for this one. So if you like the content as much as I did, then I hope you'll consider doing what you know you need to do. So you know what I mean. Anyway, I hope you live your life fabulously, and I will see you on the next one. Bye. Thank you.